Bo here. Good to see you again. Today we're going to make some tags. They are excellent for bookmarks that you can send in a card or tags for gift bags. And I've made up a few just random and you can do all kinds of shapes and we will. But in this session, we're just going to make these little rounded corner ones. On Amazon, I ordered watercolor paper four by six inch, and they're perfect face cards to watercolor. When you cut them in half, you get three inch by four inch. And then I round the edges with this little edge rounder. You don't have to do that either. It's darling if you were to keep it uh, rectangle. And then I hole punch it. I happen to be using a flower one, but any kind of a hole punch would do. It would be just as cute. So I've already cut some of these four by sixes in half, and these are the three by four inch. And we're gonna create some little cards that we can watercolor, just like these. I've made these and kept them, and I can use them as a reference and um, to make more, and then I pop them in little Goodwill cards. This is a Goodwill card. And so I made the card of cactus, and so what I used, this is a four by six card, watercolored with a little um, frame. And then I made this matching. It could be a bookmark, or you could tie the top and just hang it on your cabinet handles. But this is an example of what I'm going to send somebody. They'll get this with this inside and it matches and it's just darling. I love it. So we have these and all I'm going to do, if you can round the corners, you, that's fine. You don't have to. I honestly have not used this little corner um, rounder in quite a while and I saw this on um, Pinterest and I thought that really does make the car the that really does make the tag look a little better you could also cut these um, just out by hand, whatever shape you want. You can do anything you want to do. So here we have these and all we have to do is the little hole punch and I just use this little kind of flowery one. And then once these are pre-done, they're ready to send or give away. And I think what I'm also going to do is make a set of these, like maybe six of these maybe five of these, decorate them, put a little ribbon in them and give them away as gifts so that they can attach it to a bag or whatever. And you got the back where you can put to and from, put a little note on, they're really handy. So let's sit back, enjoy a little music and let's see. Um, let's make this one. I think, I, I think we'll duplicate that one.
Okay, so here we go. Simple, fast, easy little tag. And on the back, you could put the uh, I love you on it, the to, the from. And it's they're all unique and just darling. And the thing about this kind of style of watercolor is less is more. And if you look close, just the little dabs, incompleteness, a little smearing and smudging, leave some white spaces. And I think you'll be really happy with your little tags. Simple, easy, always at the ready, and certainly a personalized gift. See you soon.